Hey everyone, I've been having issues with my trailer brakes for the longest time. They started out intermittent and finally today I had nothing. No trailer brakes whatsoever. Lights worked, everything else worked, uh, 12 volt, volt uh, charging power worked, just no trailer brakes. I thought maybe my trailer brake controller was faulty. So I did some testing on it, it turned out fine. So I kind of narrowed it down to my seven pin plug. I figured this has got to be the issue, uh, especially since my cover on it is cracked. I checked the pins inside, I, I brushed them, I cleaned them, tried it again, nothing. So I thought, okay, maybe it's something internal. So I pulled this connector apart and discovered that the uh, corrosion inside was just beyond belief. I'll, I'll show you what I'm talking about. So when you pull, there's a screw here and a screw here. You pull these two screws out and with the wires, you have to push the wires through the back and everything pops out. The whole guts pop out the front side. So on the terminal, this is the terminal for the brake controller, for the trailer brakes. It is so badly corroded, the wire was snapped right off. Um, and that's what the inside looked like. I, I didn't even know that these came apart until today. So that's what I did. I went to Canadian Tire. I just picked up a new connector. It's already installed. I've got it on there. It's Reese, which I believe is good quality stuff. So it took me 10 minutes to wire that in. So if you're having trouble with your trailer brakes, like I was, I went through all the forms. I, I did tons of research today. I banged my head against the wall for hours, wondering what the problem was. I went through everything else on my truck, like fuses, wiring. I chased down the wiring all the way from the front, all the way to the hitch. And I found no problems there. So I figured the connector had to be the problem. So if you haven't checked this, it takes not that much effort to pull this connector apart and look at your connections inside. Cause if you're having the same issue I did, this is probably your cause. I hope this helps anyone else out there who is struggling with their trailer brakes not working. And yeah.